Hi everybody! Welcome back to the channel. If you're stopping by for the first time, you know, consider hitting the subscribe button and come back and check us out. If you're new and you've already done that, I want to welcome everybody. I want to hopefully bring you some content that you enjoy. If you're returning, hi, welcome back. Um, I had to get out today. Uh, for the first time in like four days. Um, for one, I was going stir crazy in here. Um, for two, um, I wanted to mail some mail out to a friend. So I wanted to get out and get this stuff done. So while I was out, I, um, I picked up my oldest son. I took my middle child back to his father in doing so, so I can we just kind of swap kids right now. So, um, I have, um, when I picked him up, I went by the post office and I went by the Dollar Tree. And the reason I have even trying to get anything, I'm looking for elastic. I saw something and I want to try and make some masks. Not because I go out very often, just because I think they're cool. And even if you don't use them for right now, whatever's going on, because, <clears throat> yeah, you know, it may or may not stop this virus. Consider your child has the flu, right? Keep it spreading in your house. These masks would help. Consider your kid has strep throat, right? So anything that's contagious inside your home, right, you can use. And if your kid has strep throat and you need to go somewhere, stick one of these things on them. It's nice to have. And I found one. And since my fiance was nice enough to get me a new sewing machine, I want to use it. So anyway, I while I was out today doing all those things, I'm sorry, my cats are going crazy over here. But while I was out, I went to the Dollar Tree. And I went to the Dollar Tree for two reasons. For the main reason was I've got two to three kids in this house all the time. My niece, Travis, my, my oldest son, and my middle son. And boy, teenage boys can eat you at a house and home. They have gone through a lot of snacks. So I basically went out to see if I could find some shelf stable milk and uh, elastic and snacks. So while I was there, I picked up a couple of these mailers. Um, I like to have them on hand just in case. So I picked those up. I also picked up two more of these with the flowers on the front for a DIY I'm trying to get together for you guys. Um, I picked up three different kinds of rope. This one is just the poly, uh, the poly rope right? I picked up this. I picked up the paracord in the pink. Um, and I picked up this diamond braided rope. These are, you can find these anytime at the Dollar Tree. Not, maybe not this kind, but, um, anyway, they have different colors and stuff. I picked these up because while we're starting that garden, I need things to hold things up with. Um, um, a clothesline, it's going to be nice. I got clothes pins the other day, so I want to make sure I had rope. So I got those. Okay, snacks. My kids love these. Um, uh, the buddy bars. These things will go first. If I don't feel like getting up and making breakfast, oh, the dishes are driving me crazy. Um, right here. I got... My oldest son likes the honey buns for breakfast, so I got him some of those since he was coming this time. Um, and then I got lucky. I found the Mr. Brownie in the chocolate. I found it in the Blondie Bites. It's, um, it's like chocolate chip. So, and then the two that I had not seen is the cinnamon crumb cake bites. 
And this one, which is the Galactic Brownie Bites. So we got those. And then I picked up the European Cookie Classic Shortbreads, right? Thought they might be good to, um, um, just for me to snack on. You know, if they stick around that long. Um, but real quick, down to the sticker aisle. And I'll move a little closer just so we can see these a little better. Um, I see another package of the butterflies. These are the greens. I found the yellow ones. And the blue ones. I got two of these um, alphabet stickers. I got two of them. And I got these bottled ones with the flowers. I thought those were really gorgeous. And I live at the beach. So this one right here looked really good and cool. And then this one, You Make Me Smile, Sweet Love. Live, Laugh, Love, The Story of Us. I thought that was really cute. I found this um, sticker set by, um, by Jot. You get 59 of them, and they're like trip ones. The airplane is kind of stick, uh, stick up. The camper down here sticks up, and it says... Are we there yet? Oh my gosh. Um, and then we got uh, travel, say cheese, trip, memories, let's go. In the little stickers in the back, back here. And then there are these here. So um, I thought that was really cute. So I got one of those. And then I've never tried these, but I really want to. So I picked them up. They are the self-adhesive stencils. So I picked up this one here that has like love. This one is do what you love or do what you love what you do. This one is had love and happiness. Um, hello sunshine, right? Found this one. I saw this one out. Had to get this one. Look at that owl and the fox. Look at the, what is it, trash panda they call him? <laughs> the raccoon. There's a the little bird. Um, so and it just says little friends. And then I saw this one. And I like that one. So, yeah, going to try some, uh, some stencils. Okay. At the checkout, no, on the way to the checkout, I went down the makeup aisle. And I found something that I have not seen in my store. It was, um, both of these were still in like a display and are in the box and stuff. One of them was sat in a display and um, she hadn't opened them yet and I, you know, she was in the aisle. So I asked, I was like, I don't mean to rush you or anything, but can I, and she's, she was more than helpful. I made sure that I let her know that I appreciate everything that they're doing as they are still there. Um, so, but I found these uh, Swispers. It is a silicone blender, uh, latex free for flawless blending of liquid cosmetics and I know you can't see it but it's here it's like an oval right there so um so yeah I thought eh, I'll give it a try not that I'm wearing a lot of makeup these days because I ain't putting makeup on just to stay in my house that's why I don't have any on right now 
And then these were in a display, sat, just sat in there. They were still in the um, packages. They were like three to a package or whatever. And they did have grape. They had um, pineapple and this kind. I think that was the only three that they had. And I didn't want the grape and I didn't want the pineapple. But I thought that this was gold. It is L.A. Color. Um, you are very sweet macaron. Look at that. I thought that was so cool. It's a strawberry. Um, yeah, strawberry scented lip balm. It says berry. It says berry up here and it says strawberry scented down here. And then I found this one. It is Juicy Smooches Mood Tinting Glip Gloss. And this one also is in the Jammin Berry Scent. LA Colors. So, I got that one. So, that was the two things I found that were new on the way to the stand. Then at the stand, I know to keep my eyes closed. I should keep my eyes closed, but I'm constantly looking around for anything new. And I found more notebooks. So, these are these. And it says, follow your dreams. It's got this, I don't know, it feels like rubbery front. They are lined papers. They are um, a Greenbrier product, 40 sheet notebook, and it's got the seam going right down here, right? And this one says, follow your dreams. This one says, make it happen, and it is that lime green, and you can barely see that. <laughs> but it is that lime green, and it, yeah. This one is live happy, and it is that pale blue. And this one is, well, my favorite, because it just shows up, but it is uh, choose to shine. And it is in that really pink, pink, pink. So I seen these at the checkout while I was checking out. I picked up and seen these three colors. And the lady goes, oh, you don't want the green one? I was like, uh, yes. So she helped me get the green one. So that is it, guys. That is what I picked up. Like I said, I'm looking for elastic uh, so that I can make some masks. Um, for one, it's a DIY that I've just been wanting to do. For two, I get to use my sewing machine. And for three, I think they would be nice to have even if we weren't going through this coronavirus thing. So, um, I will continue to look. I'm not going to purposely go out for it. The next time I go out will probably be something that I can combine all together. Right? So, um, anyway, I hope that everybody is doing fine. I hope that the videos that me and other YouTubers are putting out is helping your staycation go a little bit better. And I'm asking everybody, please don't judge YouTubers for going outside, right? Um, everybody has to go outside to get what they need. If you're not hoarding food, right, or hoarding toilet paper, if you're just buying what you need for the for the two weeks or the week that you get paid or whatever, then you're going to have to go out once a week. Okay? If they go out once a week to the grocery store and get something that's non-essential, okay, don't judge. Okay? For two, when we go out, we wear masks. We take our hand sanitizer. We're only touching what we need to touch. you got to you know, believe that we're doing what we can. But when we go out for our families, we're we're gonna make, you know, so I think I think it was Thrifty Diva, a Theoni that said it best. She was, if I'm gonna risk my life to go out, then I'm gonna go ahead and do some fun shopping while I'm there, you know, and nobody needs to judge anybody for what they do with their own lives. Just do what you do for your life. And let everybody else do what they do for theirs. Okay? Let's get through this together. 
right? Let's support each other, right? And help each other get through it. That's why us YouTubers are bringing you videos, bringing you different kind of videos, stepping outside of sometimes our very comfort zones to do this kind of stuff, right? So I ask everybody to be kind, not only to your neighbor, to your family, to your friends, but to your local YouTuber, okay? Everybody, all of my friends that are YouTubers, I hope that my support to everybody's channel has helped you. I appreciate you. Thank you very much, right? And everybody out there, all of my subscribers, I really want to thank you for being here for me and being here for everybody else. I want to thank you for your nice, kind words. And I ask that you continue to come on back and check out what I have next. Everybody, have a great day. Stay safe. And be blessed, my friends. Bye-bye.